de Dolide. <risos> Bokanisa ki, bokangeli ngai na ndaku. Nzo kangai nde, na kangeli bino na libanda. Hello guys, I believe you are doing good. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, it is your guy, Parfait. Yeah, since I told you guys, I'm still at home and yeah. I wanted to show you how I'm doing my gardening here at home. Uh, so far so good doing very good because with the experience I got from last year and the things I'm also doing in Limpopo it really enables me to understand much more about gardening so I want to take you uh, to the other side where I'm planting um, beetroot I also got some uh, spinach yes so i'm gonna be doing those today and i want you to see how easy it is guys it's so easy to have your vegetables at home yeah so you know life is getting tougher and once you realize it you're gonna have to check on how to uh, try and capitalize on your vegetables like your basics things that you use at home so myself i've decided to do the garden here so that I don't have to buy vegetables anymore and yeah let me maybe show you how my gardens are doing uh, so far I've planted tomatoes I've done uh, broccolis I've done the, the 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 lettuce and doing very good and I'm also doing China guys they are doing good I'm gonna show you how uh, they are actually doing from the previous video that I made and yeah let me just take you through guys so here is my China if you've watched my video the way I did this in China this is how they look like guys as you can see they're growing really good they're doing fine so here they are and uh, the ones I will be doing today, I will be planting this beetroot. There's plenty of them here, and this uh, spinach right here. Uh, yesterday I was busy. Yes, I cleared that space right there where I'm gonna put them. Let me check it through. So this is the place I'm going to be planting today. Yeah. So I'm just going to be doing this right now. I've got my organic manure here. It's a cow poop. Hey guys, I don't want to forget to show you my... Um, this is turmeric turmeric so it's just a piece of turmeric that i uh, put in water a few days ago and uh, i started shooting uh, it sprouted from the water and then i just put them uh, i buried actually here in this soil and look at them uh, the plenty couple of heads right there i think it's about one, two, three, four. Yeah, I see four guys. They're doing good. I also got here. Uh, what do I call the pumpkin? Yeah, this is a pumpkin. And uh, yeah, if I can just take you a little bit of tour on this in China right here. So they're doing good. I'm watering them every day. One of the secrets of these vegetables, you just really need to give them enough water. The other thing I did, uh, uh, I do have videos about this also. It's the broncholis. You can see I'm having issues with this. Apparently, they are so much loved 
by the bugs these ones so they easily get eaten i planted about 12 of them now i can see one two three four five six uh, a couple of them have perished and yeah here are my lettuce doing very good my mornings are never the same again so i'm having good you know salad from these lettuce yeah i've shown you this um peppermint and then i got these tomatoes guys as i said on my previous videos they've already sprouted flowers now i'm expecting them to to start fruiting they're really doing good beautiful so nice as you can see guys so so yeah the other thing we're gonna do let's just go and do this thing man before i forget let me show you some of the seeds that i'm producing here yeah. these are jalapenos very soon i'm gonna have plenty of seeds right here yeah man one of the other things that you need to look out the seeds are very expensive so when you do your gardening you really have to look out to keep some of the seeds because you're gonna need them in the near future of course if you still want to do it yeah as for me guys i'm really loving this thing it's beautiful uh at first i just love the fact that i'm doing it and it's really working it's a it's like it gives you peace of mind you know doing things and you can see that it, they they are working it's working according to the way you you want them to be so yeah let's go on guys and do this thing so yeah this thing is just gonna be very easy it's gonna be super easy guys so let's start with uh, the spinach i'm holding the camera so you guys should understand if you don't see some footages i'm doing both holding the camera and and try to do it so i can show you how i'm doing it so right now here i'm carrying how many one two three four five these are six of them so i'm just gonna transport them this way yeah for now let me put it down here so what i'm gonna do now i'm gonna try and put them in line so let me do it like let's say this one I think you can see the line I just made right here. Let me put the camera down. So, and this is how I do it. Just hold it like this and fix it right here. I consider this one done. Then I'll just hold another one.
so far in this less than 10 minutes I've planted all of the spinach I had as you can see there so they, look, they look quite small but in a matter of days guys you're gonna forget this it's gonna be also big yeah just like how I did it easy and simple so now I have a challenge I have plenty of beetroot right here and I think the space my space is very small I'm remaining with the small piece right there but let me see how I can do it guys let me see how I do it I did the spinach last year, but the beetroot now this is my really first time. So I'm gonna have to learn from this one. You know, guys, you don't have to know everything for you to start. You can start and learn from your own, you know. I always believe it's never really bad to fail. So as long as you try. It. And again, it's your own, so there's no one to judge you. So there's no reason why you shouldn't. Just try it. So yeah, this is how I'm doing my things and so far it looks working for me at least so right now I've just finished uh, planting the seedlings I've already done also the the manure and now I'm watering them and they should be just good. So, this thing is easy guys, everyone can do it. If I can do it, of course, you, know, you can also do it. There's no experience needed in doing this. It just needs you to be uh, having courage to do it. You don't need tools, you don't need anything. You just need the seeds. Just go and get your seeds guys you can get the seeds uh anywhere in uh, uh nowadays they are in every almost every supermarket you can get them at Shoprite. you can get them at builder's warehouse you can get them at chamberlain or any nurseries if you don't want to plant the seeds you can just buy your seedlings for that and i think that's very quick because then you you will just plant them immediately and you will expect uh, production very soon but yeah if you don't want to jump the seed you just need to spare another 10 15 days for the seeds to germinate before you 
yeah maybe you'll wait for another maybe another uh, 10 days so probably maybe in a month's time or depending on the kind of uh, crop that you are you are doing but yeah so if you want to start from afresh you just need to get yourself seeds and then uh, raise a bed where you can just plant them and make sure uh, you water regularly and yeah that's how it's done guys it's not so difficult right now i'm just gonna think of stopping the water because i've watered the soil alone yesterday after i've done preparing it and so it the soil was moistured already uh, before i put the seedlings in it so yeah i'm just gonna stop the water and that's it i'm done today guys anyway my my name is parfini gaze and i bring you videos every week about how i'm doing things might be gardening farming you know hobbies everywhere going out you know road trips everything i bring into the channel so if uh, you like this video please give it a thumbs up and share it subscribe to support your guy thank you very much for everything guys for those who have subscribed oh i almost forgot we have hit hundreds subscribers guys thank you very much i'm humbled uh you mean a lot to me guys thank you very much thank you thank you thank you and uh, uh yeah you might invite others to join the family we are just trying to do it the, i believe african guys should start doing things ourselves thank you very much guys and i'll see you in the next one <laughs> bye